Hi, I'm Scott Flowers with Cloud Ninjas. Today we're going to continue our series on the Dell PowerEdge R650 server. In this video, we're going to show you how to rack your server. Let's get going. Well, hey, thanks for stopping by today to learn a little bit more about the Dell PowerEdge R650 server. Do us a favor, find anything that helps you in this video, click that like and smash that subscribe. All right, let's hop in. It's going to be a pretty quick and simple video. We're going to show you how to take your server and put it in this rack behind us. So let's get into the fun stuff. All right, so now we're going to show you how to put the rails in, and then we'll show you how to put the server into the rails. So first things first, you'll notice on the rail itself, it's going to say left front. So that'll be the left front side. So uh, we're just going to line it up properly. Uh, so there's going to be two of us. Angel's going to be in the back. Help me out. So Angel, we're going to do this on number nine. So what he's going to do is he's going to take these two pegs right here as well as this third uh, little anchor and then he's going to clip them into the back side and then i'm going to do the exact same thing to the front so you go ahead and do yours first angel and, and again it's definitely a lot easier with two people you can definitely do it by yourself um, but it does make it a lot easier to go ahead and do it so all right so now that we've got this lined up i'm just going to click this into place and once it's clicked into place I physically can't pull it out it's locked in now if I did want to remove it you see this little blue button we would just pull this out and when we do that it just pops right off so this is how we'll put our rails in so I'm gonna do the right rail next all right so again on this one it's gonna say right and front so we're gonna line it up on the right front and we're gonna do nine again and again we have the same pegs everything's going to be the exact same then I'm just gonna pull mine up and then I'm gonna line it up here for number nine and just click it right into place and again it's locked into place so now if I want I will pull the inners out and the inners will lock into place themselves so you'll notice uh, right over here is this blue button that kind of pops up uh, as a whole you're just going to take this and then you can slide your rail back in to your uh, to your outer so again if you wanted to do that you will just push this button right here so, all right, now what we're gonna do is go ahead and uh, drop our server in. All right, so we're gonna start by taking the inners and just sliding them out, and they will lock into place, as we have showed you already. And once we pull them out, there's four notches, one, two, three, four, and Angel, go ahead and pull the server up. When you look on the side of the server, there's gonna be four rivets, and those four rivets are what we're gonna line up. So we're gonna start with the back two, Okay, I got mine in. And once you have the back two, you can almost kind of like a hinge, just go straight down and then just make sure that your inners are close enough. And once they go in, all four of mine just slid right in. How are yours? So you're just gonna push this back a little bit and you hear it click into place. And now it's physically locked. Angel's not holding it, I'm not holding it. It's completely locked into place. So again, if we wanted to slide this back, the button's on the side, we're gonna push those in and we'll just slide this right back in. And now it's physically locked into the rack. So if I wanted to try to pull it out, it's, it's locked into the rack. So if you wanted to actually take this out of the rack, that's what you would do. So I'll show you one more time. So it's locked, you just push the two buttons up slides right out so that's how you rack your dell r650 server well hey if you made it this far click that like smash that subscribe and if you're looking for any custom built r650s or any other dell server for that matter we do new and we do use we'd love the opportunity to earn your data center your home labs business we also do hpe cisco super micro ibm custom built as rocks or gigabytes and again please email us at sales at cloud thanks for stopping by guys take care